Hi guys, I'm Ina Iverson with the Red Carpet Report and today we are talking all about the Oscars and the Oscar gift bags. Lash Ferry, you were talking to us last time about the Grammy gift yeah. bags, but this one is pretty awesome. You have to tell us a little bit about it. Well, this is a little different than what we do for the Grammy. So, as you know, because you were there, the Grammys were gifting the presenters and performers were on site in an official capacity. It's their official thank you from the Grammy Awards to say thank you for being part of the show. This is different. We have nothing to do with the Oscars. We pick the people who get this. So we've chosen the five categories that we think are the most important. Best actor, actress, supporting actor, supporting actress, and director. And we also gift the host of the show because that is such a hard job. And that little cutie patootie Neil Patrick Harris is going to do such a great job this year. I know. So we only give 21 of them. So because it's such a smaller quantity as opposed to 150 at the Grammys, yeah. we just have bigger ticket items that we're able to attract. So this year's gift bag is worth over $160,000 that each of the Oscar nominees is going to get. You have to tell us a little bit what is in it though, because like you say, this is, this is a big, big one. It's the biggest we've ever done in terms of the dollar value. And I never think the dollar value is the signature of whether it's a great gift or not. But when you look at the gifts, and we'll go through some of them, there's just such a great and eclectic mix of things. I'm just so personally proud of this particular gift bag. Some of the big ticket items, because when you say $160,000, you're like, how can it be worth $160,000? Yeah. But it adds up quickly when you're including things like a $20,000 unlimited car rental for the year from Silver Car, this beautiful Audi A4 that you see behind me. So they'll get an unlimited number of rentals from Silver Car. They only have Audis in their fleet. It's app driven and they get even free gas. So that gift from Silver Car is worth $20,000. So pretty amazing. We've got a $12,500 luxury camping excursion for them from Terravello Tours. This is such the ultimate way to camp. So yes, you're in a tent, but you're also sleeping on memory foam mattresses with frette sheets. You've got a private chef cooking for you, hot air ballooning, bike riding. We didn't want them to have to get their own bike. So we're even throwing in a $1,200 bike from Martone Cycling that comes in all sorts of fun, vibrant, monochromatic colors. We've got Reset Yourself, which is a $14,000 gift. They come and test your hair for all sorts of toxins and mineral deficiencies, and then they reorganize your whole cabinet and your whole life to make sure you're getting the nutrients that you're missing and that they're removing the things that are toxifying your body. That is spoiling. Absolutely, they're celebrities, they deserve to be spoiled. <laughs> um, you know, we also have a piece of, there's the gift certificate for it, um, it's from F Facto. This is a piece of furniture that's worth up to $28,000. It's custom made Italian furniture designed by an architect and built by the finest Italian craftsmen. We're also helping them give back. So Halo Natural Pet Food, they were in the gift bag last year doing this and we had to have them back. They're donating 10,000 meals in the name of each nominee to an animal shelter of their choice. So last year, Julia Roberts, Meryl Streep, June Squibb, and Barkhad Abdi all chose animal shelters that were special to them to receive that donation. Yeah. And you also have like a little bit of the smaller stuff. You have like lollipops, but still with gold on. So it's like... Yeah, it's these are from Dosha Pops. And these are herbal tea infused lollipops. And because it's all about Oscar gold, uh, they've also decorated them with some nice gold flecks. We also, speaking of gold flecks, we've got La Baleine. This is oh, the wow. natural sea salt company from France. And they created a special blend with edible gold in the salt. They also, if they happen to be in the south of France for the film festival in Cannes or what have you, this is over in Provence, and they can do a tour of the salt marshes and stay in a hotel nearby, and so it's a pretty nice package for them. Yeah, that's like a little miracle bottle right there. Speaking of miracles, we've got a Rejuvel. This is a miracle cream in a jar. They're the only skincare product that uses licensed NASA microgravity technology, and I know that's a mouthful, but what it basically <laughs> means is that your skin looks friggin' amazing when you use this product. It's $150 a bottle. And they're also, like, if they're not stars enough, they're getting a star. Oh, absolutely. Yes, they're stars here on Earth, but thanks to International Star Registry, they're going to have a star named after them in the sky at the same time. That is, that is actually what amazing. Do you, somebody who has everything, you know, and that's one of the products that's always been on my list of things to give somebody. It's such a great gesture. Um, in that same vein, we've got Latin Low, and this stands for Latitude and Longitude. And what I love about it, it's a jewelry company that inscribes their jewelry with a location of personal significance. So where you got proposed to, where you got married, where you were born. Mine, of course, is Barbara Streisand's address in Malibu. Yeah. Um, so it all depends on the person. But what the nominees are getting, it's the latitude and longitude of the Dolby Theater. Um, so they'll always have a lasting memory of the night. That is so nice. Out of all the things here this year, what would you say is your favorite? 
gosh, I have so many favorites, yeah. but I have to say I'm a diet junkie, so probably the hydroxy cut gummies. I use these every day. I've turned on so many of my girlfriends with this product. They're chewable gummies, so it feels like you're eating a gummy bear, so it satiates that sweet craving, but it also suppresses your appetite. So I'm a little addicted to these. I love them. I, I would probably eat them like candy. That's They're kind of like that, but then you just don't want as much candy, so that's fantastic. We also have incredible artwork. A friend of mine who's a local L.A. artist, Gunnar Fox, is providing $5,000 pieces of art. They get to go into his local L.A. studio and pick one out or from his catalog. Uh, so that's another favorite item of mine. And also these pop dental toothbrushes. Who doesn't love a hot pink toothbrush? They're the fastest sonic toothbrush on the market, but also the most beautiful. What is the most difficult thing for you to get in the gift bag? Physically to get in the gift bag or just to find people to donate? Fine. The bike was pretty hard. Yeah. We really wanted to find a bike to have them go on their Terravello Tours trip with. Yeah. And we talked to several companies and it was always sort of a budgeting issue and they didn't have enough inventory. And you know, a lot of these bike companies are pretty small and, and it's a little bit hard to get inventory from them. But when we came across Marta, we were like, what will it take to make this happen? And luckily the owner of the company who used to be in the fashion world just got it immediately. I mean, if you can understand the value of having Julianne Moore, you know, riding a bike from them down the streets of New York um, would be pretty impressive. So we're hoping to see that happen. Do you get to try out everything yourself. Absolutely. I've got a <laughs> test market, quality control. I've got a gold Martone bike on order. I'm pretty sure your house looks pretty nice then. Yeah, I've got a $28,000 couch that I've got some designs <laughs> I'm figuring out now, so that'll be a nice little addition. Well, we're really excited about the Oscars, and I think that the stars will definitely see this as a win anyway. So far, they have. You know, we've gotten a lot of good feedback from the stars over the years. It will be interesting to see on Sunday.